he enters to try to make his bid to strip Roy Jones of murder when he stabbed an uncle who, as it turned out, had abused 25 fights, 23 of them by KO. He's also... Knockout, one of the 33 Jones has scored in his career. Well, good luck, 12 rounds. Some good, rough, tough price fighters. Take advantage of that and keep the fight at close range. Enough to say, hey, he's a big puncher. I'm certainly going to be careful that he had broken a bone in his wrist. That tall as Hall is, you don't want to do anything but just stick your hands out. Hall reaching with the left. Now he puts power behind the right hand and down goes Hall. Just hold it. He's not going to do that. Hold on and get Jones. He has not been a good finisher in a long time. Good point. Because we're about to see a third. Hall is a very big target for a light Jones. We'll go after a guy in the first round, test him to see. How now get out there and circle and move your head. That move his head. You got to stand up tall. Don't even put your head down there in his range. It's a little better than in round one. Circling. He is remembering the tab. I can tell you this, real thing is at your level. Cut missed. To a corner and invites Hall in. And Hall is landing good. Thing to land the left to the body. Gets through round two. Had an opportunity to look as spectacular as he had. 59 punches. Jones 25 of 45. You heard Alton Southpaw. For the moment. One day is going to fighting out of the southpaw stance. Jones bombs. I keep throwing up out of the range. Don't be like the win. He's throwing a lot of hard shots, and that's what you do. Make the guy think different. Yeah, when a guy gets real comfortable with Roy, he will turn southpaw. Is Roy Jones? You're not that eager. That Shot to the body. Body. Oh, more speed now. You're doing okay. As long as the fight goes, we're all right. Harold Letterman, how do you score it? Through the offense, it's very close to a backhand. He's got to throw that right jab. You know, with a his business, trying to take him down. Punch. He stands in front of Jones and allows Jones to got a throw shot. Roy Jones body up. Landing to Jones's rib cage, and now Jones in loose. Protected. Quick left hook inside. Straight right. Punches that shocked him in the first round. Yo, Jones is doing a lot of slapping. And a left hook as well against Roy. Richard Hall is throwing 54 punches. Not ready for this level of competition because he was a mandatory challenger. Who no. In the, in the mind of everybody because straight right hand oh those body punches. say it up front Paul's a lot better than I thought he would be then he moves his left uh, his body here in the fifth round Jones is one of those show for the Indianapolis fans Paul has speed and and with his hand speed to go with it he just feels like one round of Jones Pazienza five years ago and there's a big right hand the nerve to get cocky and that's what you want to do. Whatever the clowning was about, this was not something that... Power shots, 73%. Throwing them from all angles. Everybody's impressed, but I'm still here. Go. You yourself said, George Foreman, that... The reason to what he's doing, go to the body two or three times and then... Fight heavyweight champions, Bob Foster, Jose Torres, going back... There is swelling all across the face and the bridge. Well, he's following a puncher and at the and right. Don't just go straight to him. Let's see if we can catch where they yeah. decided as a no knockdown round could be. It was an exhibition. As much as a, I got a, I got a comment, Jim. I've never seen anything in 30. This is where he has problems. He's a good counter puncher and a.
turning southpaw again. He did some damage from this position. The, instead of just thinking of landing a big punch. Goes, as I should say. And Jones switches back to his convention. You know, the referee has taken good looks at Richard Howell now. The crowd would certainly appreciate. Roy is, has left. Tell us anything at all about what Jones would do against a heavyweight. True. That's true. He's writing a book of his own. Punches. And now Aaron Snow begins to say to his fighter, well, what the... i got to say this about Roy Jones. He's one of the most conditioned fighters. You know, our HBO advertisements show... Still has his legs into the body in this division. You better... Well, you wonder, I think, Larry. It wouldn't hurt. Go to towel. The towel wouldn't be a bad idea, would it? Games. And the people in the corner have only one... A lot of bullets. Array, the way he's using Hall. Richard Hall has had a very hard life. Over and over by an uncle. So he's had a way. I like it. He's got a heart as big as Jamaica. George, you sound like you're selling a hamburger Not between here. But you know what? Be on. The best fighters, they come alive. He's best beating of shots and the like. What they do, they sit down on their stoop. Chin. Until he takes a world-class beating. Harold Letterman. Well, it's a no contest already. Anyway, huh? And Hall has wobbled, grabbed, worked his way around the ring. Let me ask you this, George. You've seen Roy Jones hit Hall. I don't know. This is some extraordinary phenomenon in boxing. Against the guy who deserves to go home. Again, I say throw. Richard Hall has never fought past the 10th round in his professional career. Target practice continues in Indianapolis. Left on his punches. He's taken a brutal beating. Jones. Jones just popping in the buttons. This is absurd. Stop the fight. Should not be taking these shots. Thank God. Isn't that horrendous? You like them. We like these guys. They should. As long as he took to stop this fight. This is the beginning of the round. Beating another man to a pulp for no reason. No, he, he got to do it. You got to throw punches, I guess. Let's go to Mike. The winner by TKO victory. Junior. Four punches. You know, it's going to be more madness. 273 out of 400. The point was, as I indicated earlier, he was in the fight by 